Hey guys, it's been a while since I've done a merch drop like this. You want to get some fairy tale stuff? Because the fairy tale thing coming to my channel soon. The fairy tale roleplay on my channel is coming soon. And you can buy merch down below in the description. I would suggest you do that. Please, please buy it though. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not joking. Before the video starts, I would like to ask that you guys subscribe to my channel, turn on the bell for notifications, leave a comment down below, and like the video. I would heavily appreciate it. Hope you enjoy. The content within this video is not suitable for children. Viewer discretion is advised. I'm getting sick of this place. How do I even start a conversation like that? Realizing, huh? If I want to keep Marcus safe, then I need to talk to people. Because I doubt they'd want to fucking waste resources on a kid or something, right? That's what they'd say anyways. Just make simple demands. Then again, who knows, they might... Might screw over this place. Take away some of my rights, or whatever the fuck, right? <sighs> okay. What's the worst that can happen, right? I mean, the whole world's gonna end anyway, so... Hey, not sure if uh, you guys are watching or not, but uh, Harkman, I'd like to talk. Harkman, <laughs> sorry, you uh, usually you were in somewhere else. Um, you want to talk? Yeah. Now. I, I think, I think, I think he is just fine as is. I don't see a purpose for. I meant in the room, Harkman. I don't think you can really make requests like this, but I shall come in and see. All right. Great. This up, I'm gonna be back at square one or zero. Hello, five one six two. So, um, is there a, a reason you wanted to talk about? Well, whatever it is you want to talk about. I know what's gonna happen. I I I know. I know something's going to happen. I'm uncertain about what you mean, exactly. Um, I know, Harkman, Har I- I was there when- I- I- I did! I captured... Vince... For you guys, and he kept spouting on some insane nonsense about the sun blowing up, or... Whatever kind of crap that was. I was there. And he talked about it. And now, I hear from, from Kat that you're trying, you're, you're worrying about something, and it's, <laughs> she asked me what Vince said about the sun and everything like that. So I'm asking you now, what's going to happen? Had to bring it up with us being watched by Reginald. You're not exactly privy to know that type of information. I'll be quite honest. Any and all information about any research outside of your own is... Well, strictly for us to know and for you not to find out. 
And I, 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 I let you put a fucking chip in my head. It's not a chip. It's in my head. So you can fucking control this thing. Okay, I think I'm allowed to know something. There is a Napoleon level event, and it might be happening soon, or it might be happening later, or it might never happen at all. In our lifetimes, anyways. What the fuck is a Napoleon level event? <laughs> End of the world scenario. So you know about it then. I can't talk about it in the details. All right, fine. Don't talk about it. You don't get my help. You can't make that claim right now. You can't. I don't. I'm not going to fucking help you with your little experiment thing if I don't get something in return. You want information? The information wouldn't be helpful to you in any way. No, I don't... Okay. <laughs> I guess the information would have helped me gauge how much this is important. Right, but the way you're describing it, it seems really important. So I have only a couple requests for you, Harkman. And what would that be? I want an audience. With one of those fucking O5 members. You don't make demands of O5. Remember the last time you tried doing this? You lost everything in that room. I don't care. I want to speak to an O5 member right now. You know what? It is your funeral, more or less. They won't be angry at me as much of you, but I shall get to work on that. Just sit tight. Fucking polygon level event. What kind of shitty name is that? <sighs> Doesn't make any fucking sense. play the waiting game now. Are we really doing this? I'm sorry, what? Are we really going to get him an O5 member? The situation, he would probably get one within the hour. Maybe even two. <laughs> Probably will be two. Two has been quite fascinated with him. Mm -hmm. Seemingly. How many family members do you have, Regine? Or is it just you and your daughter? Alive? Alive. Just my, just my mother and daughter. Yes. You should be fine then. What do you mean I should be fine? What I mean by that is that you won't have to pick between too many people. Mm. 
I get the idea. So that's how drastic we're going with this. Everything will be moved underground. That's what I think, so anyways. Everything. This is what the world's coming to. But they're abandoning their ideologies. To cure, contain, protect. Now it might just be about survival. I haven't told Kat yet. But she's a smart girl, she might have pieced it together already. But you... You've read up on 001, have you not? No. Multiple theories, I guess. We have one confirmed. The rest were just fairy tales to just spare. Perhaps speak a little louder, Reggie. I couldn't hear you too well. It'll be fun to explain to a curious young teenager that we're now moving on. <sighs> yes. It's the sun. What's going to happen to the Eventually. Sun? I believe I read that theory. I'm not sure when it'll happen. He's the only thing that could give us a warning ahead of schedule. We don't even know if it's in the next year or ahead of that. <clears throat> I'm sorry. What? We don't know if it's going to be a year or two years from now? No. Or a month. It could be years. Could not be. But now he holds the cards, as he has what the council needs. Information. Davis has always been one for his theatrics. I think this is a bit more than theatrics right now. But we shall see. I've been here for a goddamn hour. I think. There's no goddamn clock. There is no clock in here. It's so hard to keep track of anything. Everything looks the fucking same. <sighs> well, 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 if it isn't the balls he won himself. Oh. Who the fuck are you? I'm O2. Pleasure. So you're just black and white? What is this? I, I wouldn't... <clears throat> no, no, no. He's curious, that's why I like him. Yeah, I'm black and white. The world didn't have color to begin with. I'm the only thing about that past. Plus a couple of other fun features. Fun features. <laughs> right. Well, I don't really care for that stupid crap anymore. I figured you didn't. <clears throat> so you want to just cut right to the chase then? That's what I'm here for. What's, what, what do you want to talk about, 516? Some world war. Some world ending event, right? That's what it is. That's why you had this whole damn thing installed in me. Otherwise, you wouldn't give a damn. 
you're right about that much. Although, I will admit, your attitude, your abilities, you do interest me, as well as others on the council. Ah, well, great. <sighs> well, seeing as it's a world-ending event, I got one request. All right. More like a demand, otherwise you don't really get anything. My son. What about him? I want him safe. When it happens. One kid. Yeah. I can work that. Well, that's it. No, uh, no demand, no denials, no anything. Davis, tell me, with all the resources we have, do you think us bringing one kid into a safe haven from the end of the world is the craziest demand you could have made? You could have asked us to drop a nuke on some place you didn't like. And we would have thought about it. At least I would have. Well, really, that's, that's... That's the whole thing, huh? Oh, you were gonna just tell me to fuck off and you take away more of my rights? <laughs> like I said, you interest me. But... Let me make sure you understand something, 5162. You don't make demands here. I think I'm, I'm pretty sure. slide, because I like you. If you were any other SCP, I'd have you drawn and quartered. Don't threaten me. Hmm. And don't make demands of us. I could drain the color from you and watch you bleed out. <laughs> All right. Can we have to find a way to fucking? hour for that yeah we'll get your kid any other questions what exactly is happening because I wasn't even told anything I was just put it I had this thing implanted in my head and, they, and then you can make my goddamn eyes roll in the back of my head that's about it is this a well, need-to-know basis? Because I feel like I'm in the need-to-know, considering. You are. So, I'll privy you with a little bit of information. You've spoken with the cloaked bastard, 05, right? <laughs> yeah, once. Well, he's not from this world. Different planets exist different stars I thought that would shock me all right just so happened that O5's original home planet had this same cataclysm happen the sun is going to go through a phase for basically the rest of its lifetime anybody stuck in the light will be turned into essentially a giant pile of sentient mush and those sentient piles of mush will turn into a giant glob. And you won't be you, but you won't be dead. Essentially, you're in eternal agony. <laughs> okay. 
We turn to fucking goo monsters. Is that it? Essentially. But when they combine their powers, supposed to increase, they'll try and collect more. If they get a hold of you, they'll pull you into the light and make you one of them. And they also gain the previous person's knowledge. Which is why we're being very diligent about researchers and very diligent with this information. Indeed. So, as you can understand, we do need you. Oh my god. What the, the fucking planet is that we live underground? Yes. The only the thing facilities are already underground. They're being expanded currently to suit more people. God. We're saving as much close family as possible, but even then, we only have limited locale. Other people live, they have bunkers, whatnot, but as to how long, it's a different story. Too, I don't mean to sound rude, but you did tell the other governments, did you not? Yes, we did. As to how many believed us, that's a different story. True. But there is still one major threat around, aside from this end of the world. What? Abel. We never seen anything like that. Now that I think about it, if Abel is, well, melted down, he could... Exactly. And then those things wouldn't become killable at all. They just so, come back here. You have one other job, 5162, before the end of the world. You would fucking get Abel. Yeah. Fucking Cain and Abel, what is this biblical bullshit? Don't worry. For now, that's not the main concern. For now, get comfy. Do a little bit of training and whatnot in your cell. When the time comes, you're gonna get through a little bit of hell. And as a reward, we'll allow you something else other than your kit. How much time until this thing happens? We don't know. That's why I had this fucking thing. Exactly. It's more of insurance for us, but still. There likely will come a time when we have to stay awake for an extended period of time. I've even... That's talk for another time, but, um... Yes. I believe me and... Uh, is there any other questions, 5162? Because I don't think there's much else we can tell you. Abel. Right? Abel. Yeah. How do I deal with that? You're do smart. I, do, I, do I capture him? Do I... what? Well, you can't kill him. So you have to capture him. Or okay, convince well, him to come back. Well, technically you could kill him. He just... would come back at some point. We still have the esophagus, I think, right? The coffin thing? Yes. But... I'm not sure 5162, a simple military man, can kill Abel. Oh, shit. 
some FTF I've been able to do it in the past. Yeah. That was mainly luck, wasn't it? Indeed. Well, I won 6 2. You have an infinite amount of tries. I would say Abel is your next priority target. Maybe followed by Ferdinand, but. Uh, Ferdinand's manageable. Most he'll do is eat a couple of people. <laughs> Still haven't gotten any reports of that. Might have picked no. up something on Abel, though. I'll look into it. Fuck. If anything on Abel or Ferdinand comes up, you're going after whichever one comes up first. <sighs> right. <laughs> Shit. Remember 5162. You're useful. On that note, I'll be taking my leave. Thank you, O2. I yeah. shall also be. Don't let it happen again. Yes, O2. That's what it is. Fucking Cain and Abel. Abel's gotta be a fighter. Simple ma man with military experience. I can probably handle it. Yeah. I can handle it. Whatever the fuck Abel's able to do, I can do it. <laughs> Abel's Abel. <laughs> Funny. Doesn't matter. 